today's declaration is I am free from fear. Now we've had this before in our newsletters, but it's one that keeps coming knocking on the door. Fear keeps coming knocking. So something we need to constantly be reminded of and constantly be strengthening ourselves in the Lord against the temptation to go into fear. This morning I went to the hospital because I was getting a bit worried that the baby wasn't the baby in my tummy wasn't moving enough and they wanted to just check me out so in I went and praise the lord all is fine baby is healthy well there's nothing to worry about but it definitely got me thinking about worry and fear because I was trying to fight fear this morning and I was looking at all sorts of verses around fear writing them down and trying to speak truth over myself and so today is going to be a different sort of a vlog and I'm just going to invite you to close your eyes, sit back and let this whole bunch of scripture around fear wash over you and cleanse your mind and your heart and set you free from fear. And the funny thing about fear is it's often about things that never even happen. So an acronym for fear is false evidence appearing real. F-E-A-R, false evidence appearing real. Uh, for example, for me this morning, it was, oh gosh, is the baby moving enough? Ah, and my mind was wanting to go and begin to meditate on things that could be wrong or go wrong. So fear is faith in the wrong kingdom. It's basically meditating on things, bad things that could happen, rather than faith is hopeful expectancy of good things coming or yeah exactly so fear and faith are basically opposite and fear is a total robber we really don't want to be in fear so enjoy these scriptures have your brain and your heart washed and renewed and pass this video on to anyone else who needs it Isaiah 26 3 you will keep him in perfect peace whose mind is stayed on you because he trusts in you Psalm 112, 7. He will not be afraid of evil tidings. His heart is steadfast, trusting in the Lord. Isaiah 41, 10. Fear not, for I am with you. Do not be dismayed, for I am your God. I will strengthen you. Yes, I will help you. I will uphold you with my righteous right hand. Psalm 27, 1. The Lord is my light and my salvation. Whom shall I fear? The Lord is the strength of my life. Of whom shall I be afraid? Isaiah 54, 17. No weapon formed against you shall prosper. And every tongue which rises against you in judgment. You